the Olympic Stadium in Berlin, viewed from any angle. From close in or further back, it's very evident that this is no run-of-the-mill sporting arena. This is a place where history has been made, and not always the positive kind. Berlin's Olympic Stadium, quite unique and very big. Built for the 1936 Summer Olympics, the imposing stadium would bear witness to the darkest chapter in Germany's history. It survived the Second World War largely intact and was subsequently revamped by the Allied forces stationed in West Berlin. The stadium then resumed life as a sports venue, minus the Nazi symbolism of old. It's steeped in history, of course, and it's certainly big. It's old and it's been renovated, and I think it's a fine stadium. The most recent makeover was completed in 2004, and nowadays it has a capacity of just under 75,000. This is home for Hertha Berlin and their many fans. On the East Terrace especially, it's just fantastic when the players run out to this sea of Hertha scarves. The East Terrace sets the tone for the whole stadium. However the team are faring in the league, the fans are there for them and proud of it. We always believe the team can win, even if that's not realistic, but we just give it everything. And you can hear that and see it. Vast and capacious, the Olympic Stadium is no dedicated football arena. For all that, the match day atmosphere here is incomparable for players and fans alike. It's louder, friendlier, more passionate. It's just Berlin, basically. Hertha's home ground. It's no exaggeration in this case to say it truly is more than just a stadium. Oh my goodness. That's a bit of showboating for you. Bender didn't like that at all. Lewandowski goes through it again. Oh, he just can't do it. You just cannot be that good. We're very happy. We're very pleased because we get these three points.